back away with Devil's Digest here with Kareem Moore following Wednesday's practice. So most freshmen come in here and just want to start and contribute. You've been starting for these games. Has that really surprised you, the level of productivity you've been able to um, give to the team this year? Uh, not really. Uh, you know, uh, me and Coach Ball and Coach Graham we sat down. Oh, I came in with something about how big of an impact I was going to have, so uh, just going through what we said. In fall camp, you were at corner and you got moved to safety due to Armand Perry's injury. How was that adjustment for you, and do you feel like you want to go back to corner or stay at safety? Uh, I don't think it's that big of an adjustment for me doing playing in high school. You know, I've been playing it for like three and a half years in high school, so it wasn't that big of an adjustment, but uh, I like them both, so I don't really mind playing either one. Most uh, people, you know, come in with high expectations for the year, but did you really see yourself leading the Pac-12 in interceptions, and you're tied nationally for fourth in the country for most interceptions? Uh, I didn't. I did not see that coming. Uh, I just, just wanted to come in, you know, like I said, make a big impact. Talk about that interception against uh, U of A last week. Was that one of your career highlights so far in your short time you've already been here? Yeah, uh, yeah, it, it probably was my career highlight. Uh, me just uh, picking that off and then getting to see Gino uh, tear come down his face and it made me happy. I got to get it done for him. Uh, and what, talk about the crowd noise. It was a sold out game. You know, biggest crowd you've had here at home so far this year. What did it mean to do that in front of that big of a crowd? Uh, it meant a lot. You know, uh, let me know that I can play on a big stage like that. And then, so coming, we're playing Cal this, or ASU's playing Cal this upcoming weekend. They've struggled in their past few games, but still have a really strong offense, passing offense specifically. What are you guys looking to do to stop them? Uh, you know, we're just looking to get down, get our, get our hands on them, try to get picks off uh, Jared. He's a good quarterback, you know, and he makes turnovers as well. So we just uh, look to put pressure on him. And what are your expectations for next year? After having such a great starting year, where do you see yourself going next year? I keep working very hard, very hard. Don't slack, don't slack at all. Great, thank you. And again for Devil's Digest, I'm here with Korea Moore.